afternoon of our eight day hunt and I've just doing a run around these dams and um, come across a mob of goats. It's a lot cooler today, it was only sort of 32 degrees so the goats were very quiet this morning. But anyway, come across this fella, put an arrow in him, um, he's, he's made it just 30 inches, he's a bit snapped off on this side but um, anyway, he's a 30 incher nonetheless. It's my 13th goat for the trip. So I've had a pretty good run on the goats, but a bit light on for the pigs. Only, um, yeah, I've only shot four balls, I think, for the trip, and one only one decent sized fella. So pigs have been a bit light on. Anyway, the goats have been good. But this fella absolutely nailed him through both shoulders. He's only ran from the edge of the dam there behind me. There's a little watering hole. He's run from there to this tree, let it down, and died. But what I noticed when I pulled the arrow out, it was almost passed completely through. It was just hanging on by the fletches. Little uh, three blade Oz cut. And it's actually snapped off one of the blades. You can see there. That blade there, it's just been snapped off. Just from passing through the shoulders, so yeah. Good little heads, nonetheless, very tough. I'm really happy with them, but um, yeah, wouldn't expect that to happen when it hasn't impacted the dirt or anything. It's just gone through two shoulders, but anyway. Yeah, so I'll knock the legs off this fella. I'll take home some dog meat now that got a bit of room in the fridge and it been the last day. So hopefully we've got enough time. Still got a few hours of light left. See if we can pick up maybe another goat or hopefully a pig or two this afternoon would be very nice.